Sal and welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for being here. Today is the start of a brand new series where we talk about skincare technology. This is for my skincare connoisseurs, the people that take skincare really seriously, but also too for my brand new estheticians or estheticians that are looking for new products for their spa room. So before we get started, hit the subscribe button, share this video with somebody you think might like it, and let's do it. So to get started with this series, I'm bringing to you a product called the Mayo Lift. And I want to thank 7E Wellness so much for partnering with me on this video. So what this is, is this is a microcurrent device that was actually created for the esthetician studio, but has now made it to retail. So you can get esthetician or spa results, but at home. And also too, it is something that I currently use in my spa um, to this day. And actually during this video, I'm going to be including a video that I did recently with a client. She is 60 plus years old and we did my lifting facial, which is obviously what it sounds like. So what this machine is, is I just love that you can get this retail as well as it's spa grade. So you, get, you can feel really good about having it. It has a great price point. So if you're introducing microcurrent to your spa, this is a great place to start, okay? So the reason being is that because when you look at this machine, it has a lot of different settings, but what's really special about this is it has an erase setting and it also has a educate setting. So the erase is to obviously erase lines on the skin. So obviously anywhere in the forehead, uh, the 11s, anywhere around the mouth, um, uh, you know, the nasal labial folds, as well as the educate setting. Now the educate setting is going to be for lifting and firming. Let me show you what the machine looks like turned on. So for when you start, you want to start with this number right here, and it's just what it turns on, and that's exactly where you want to start. And as you kind of build up your muscles, you can turn up the intensity. So I always like to start on level one and then go to level two. Now this client could take level two. Um, she didn't feel any sensation, so we actually stuck with level two for a race and educate. Uh, but it's super simple. You literally just push, like say, level one erase, and then you go run, and then this little bar right here that's flashing will tell you if you have conductivity, which means that you're actually doing what you're supposed to be doing, and if it's blinking, then you don't. So it keeps you really in check on knowing if the machine is working or not. And then when you go to level two, it's this number right here, but you can also go up a little bit on intensity um, after you get going after a few weeks. So it is a microcurrent device, but when you're using this, you're using two probes. They also sell this with gloves. So if you're more of a hands-on person, the gloves would be a better option for you. If you like the probes, then these are gonna be for you. Make sure you check in the description box for all the deals that are happening right now with this machine because there are some great ones. Um, and then I, got, I have a little discount code in there for you as well. Now, the reason why I love this is because microcurrent is a really important part of our skincare routine, especially when you are trying to provide a service for clients in your studio, as well as using this at home. So I'm gonna split this up a little bit. We're gonna talk about protocol and uh, what I recommend for estheticians, and then obviously protocol and what I recommend for people using this at home. Okay, so what the reason why I think microcurrent done this way is so important um, is because you shouldn't really feel like a pull and tug when you're doing microcurrent. It should be very comfortable on the skin. It should be very comfortable for your client on the skin. But what it's doing is it's training the muscles underneath your skin to do something different. So either to, you know, relax the muscles on the forehead or to obviously lift and firm the jowls as well as the nasal labial folds, you know, under the eyes, etc. Now, um, you can see in this video that this treatment takes about, I'd say, an extra 15 to 20 minutes. I like to spend a little extra time, so if I have some, I will spend between 20 and 25 minutes on this. 
um, especially when this is the whole point of the facial. Now, when you are an esthetician, the protocol is to have them do a series with you, which is fantastic for packages. So what I recommend is to have them come in to see you a couple times a week for several weeks. Uh, my package is between two to three weeks. It just depends on what they need, how many uh, fine lines they have, how lax their skin is, that kind of a thing. And then what they'll do is they'll come in once a month to you and either get this a standalone treatment or they'll get this added to whatever facial you are doing. If you are an esthetician, this does go first before all of your other stuff. So you're gonna cleanse and then you're gonna do this machine and then you're gonna go into the rest of your protocols that you wanna do for that facial. Now, if you're using this at home, you're gonna be using this, if you can, about 10 minutes every day. Now, you're gonna get faster results because you have it at home. And I think you can see, and I'll show here some before and after pictures of just one treatment with this machine, the drastic results you can get with this machine. So when you're doing this at home, if you can do it every day, great. If you can't, just a couple times a week for a few weeks. And then all you have to do is just maintenance. So you'll have to do once once a week, basically. So after you kind of get that initial kind of phase done, you'll just have to do maintenance. And it's really, really simple. The learning curve is not big and it's really kind of uh, very user friendly. This machine does come with a whole pa pamphlet that really walks you through how to do everything with really great um, you know, illustrations and things of that nature, because I know that that can be a little daunting if somebody's just brand new into this and using it at home. Don't worry, the instructions are amazing on that as well. And then obviously you can refer to this video and see how I'm doing it on her skin. Now, why is microcurrent so amazing? Well, A, because it's gonna give you, especially with this machine, um, it's gonna tell the muscles to relax whenever you have your fine lines. And then it's gonna also tell the muscles to firm up when you're trying to firm certain parts of the face. Um, this is an FDA cleared machine. I really wanna make sure you know that because this is really important. And this is really a great alternative to any kind of surgery that you might be looking at or if you do not wanna use Botox. Um, if you do use Botox and fillers, I recommend to wait between two to three weeks after you get those done to use this machine. This machine also provides hydration too in the skin because you use it with their gel, okay? So their gel also is great for you know connectivity, obviously with the machine, but also with, um, they have great ingredients in here that promote hydration for the skin so it's not going to be dry after the treatment. So as we age, we lose something called ADP. And basically in simple terms, ADP is basically where the skin loses its elasticity. It loses its memory to stay taut and tight. And so what microcurrent does is this does encourage more ADP, okay? And over time by using this, it will be a permanent thing. Yes, you will have to do a maintenance phase, but it will be something that is just part of your routine. Just like if you use red light therapy or, um, um, you know, facial uh, rollers or gua sha or anything of that nature or uh, your skin perfector from Lemieux, that type of thing. So that's why microcurrent is so invaluable and you have to buy this machine once and then it lasts forever. It's a lot less cost of, uh, costly than Botox or filler or a facelift or something like that. So that's why this. Now, I don't really um, subscribe to a ton of microcurrent machines because in my opinion, they just don't work very well. And you do have to use them honestly like every day forever and ever and ever, okay? So this machine is a little bit different. So that's why I love bringing you new machines that I get introduced to. I have used them in my clinic for several months. I feel really good about telling my fellow estheticians as well as my beautiful squad community um, that this is something that you look into. This is again for that are really looking for a dra dramatic and drastic change in their skin. If you are fed up with um, you know fine lines and wrinkles, don't want to do Botox, jowls, your nasal labial folds, this is going to be a great machine for you. And I think you can see with the before and after just one treatment on this um, young lady that I love, um, she has just had amazing results. So she is going to be on my membership plan where she comes in three times a week to get this done. Um, and it's a standalone service for me personally whenever I do this without the facial and it's about 30 minutes. Kind of to round this out, the big thing is to, if you're doing this at home, you're going to see in these videos is that both probes are always touching the skin. 
And when you are educating, when you're lifting, you want to do a pinching motion. I don't know of very many uh, microcurrent machines that are out on the market that are for consumers as well as professionals that do this pinching motion. This pinching motion is super important to really train that muscle uh, to make sure it's doing what it's supposed to do. So you basically hold each section about three to five counts and you do each section three times. I go over it a little bit more if there's specific areas of you know concern that I wanna get really targeted that, that time or if she's going to an event the next day, that kind of a thing. When you, um, when you erase, you wanna take the probes and you wanna go in opposite directions. One, you know, one, two, so you go one, two, three, and then you're gonna do this again three times. And it's really important to stretch what you want. I've been really working on this line right here. Yes, I do get Botox, but this line is just something that I deal with. It's not gonna be, I, you know, I don't personally do fillers, um, so I've been working with this machine on this line specifically. Um, I also just love that this machine doesn't give you like a pull and tug situation, like where the muscles kind of contract on top. For me personally, it is just um, a much more comfortable experience. So let me know if you guys have ever heard of microcurrent. Let me know if you guys use microcurrent in your um, spa setting right now. I just, the price point is really great for this, especially for my estheticians that are starting out and really wanting a fabulous product that they can really get good results with but not spend a ton of money. And it's also, once you charge it, it's also portable. So it has, doesn't have to be stuck to a wall. So if you're in a small space uh, like me, I like it because it's portable and I don't have to, you know, bring my whole cart over. All right. So let me know again if you guys use microcurrent, what you guys think. Um, if you guys have tried this machine before, um, it's called the Myo Lift and it is such a beautiful product. I'm so thankful that they allowed me to chat with you guys about this. I hope you like this new series. It's going to be very informative and very educational on new skincare tools that come out. So if you have anything you want me to review, let me know and I will do that for you. Thank you all so much for being here and I'll see you in the next one. Lots of love for me to you. Bye loves.